right, there we go then. Hello guys, welcome back to Gusta Confessions for another bonus video. This is, we've got a big one this time. This is, we're talking about free videos. Free videos in this one. So this could be like a big one. So it's another one of those ones I talk about, or like a range or something like that, you know, what I've had. And today we're talking about free videos, which actually, um, one I do, I've, I've, I've alluded to this and talked about this in a previous video. I did. I actually talked talked about it and um, did a little, bit of a little bit of history about it. So today we're talking about the Wolves exclusives, the children's preschool favourite vi videos really, from 1992 to 1995. Although we're talking about three, there's a fourth one, which I never owned, which I'll get to eventually. So you'll, you'll know which one it is. These were released by Woolworths in, again, like in, in, in the early mid-90s, just like a promotional thing really. And um, they've probably been, pro again, it's more like a promotion thing. You get vouchers in it as well. Yeah, it was a nice promotion. It was done by the video collection, of course, which obviously, it, it, you know, they had links for Woolworths. They sort of emerged out of Woolworths in the 80s, they did. So the video collection and Woolworths are sort of mink, are like intermingled together, really, in history. And so obviously these are just promote new titles, the shows, maybe like new stock of the selling, really, at the time. I don't know if it worked. I'm not entirely sure. It might have done in those days, really. Let's not be around the bush. Let's get through these. So first up we go to Children's um, Preschool Special Collection from last night too. I think it's one of my favourites this is, you know, out the bunch. Nice bit of variety, and it's also a different section as well, which I'll get into as well. Nice plain white sleeve, and it's colourful, playful um, collage art as well, which is nice. Now all these come from Carbide itself, they did. The first two, for what I remember, came from one in an old airfield just outside of Grange over Sands. So Children's Preschool Special Collection, I'll go for the stories of course. So first of all is Thomas Tension, Thomas the Tension Friends of course, we have po uh, Thomas Percy the Post Trim, good story from series 3, one of my favourites. Then we've got Rosie and Jim, learn to read and write with Rosie and Jim. So it's an expert, excerpt clip from, yeah I do have the games and songs where I think Stories and Rhymes is, is, the other, is the other one, which obviously Stories and Rhymes extracts on this video. And it's alright really, it's just them to just read, read and write a story about about a goldfish called Scowly, something like that. Uh, nothing much really. I'm just, I'm just thinking, you know, maybe I don't know. I don't know. It's like new stuff, so there's promoting stuff out there. And then we've got Playbox, which I've reviewed on Path of Nostalgia years back. Um, it's not down a very thin Playbox, really. And it's just, you know, it's to do with buses. Children going. To, uh, I think the NSC episode. It's a bit like Teletubbies in some regards, like an early precursor of Teletubbies. Um, you know, they sort of, you know, cast a dog in this box and you teach about stuff and press this thing with shapes that come out and stuff like that. It's like, okay. You know, and it cuts to, you know, just modern life of children going on a bus or doing everything else. It's basically that sort of thing. Play boxes are sort of the early precursor to type. It's like a predecessor to that thing. And then we've got Brum, of course. This is from Series 1, this is. So it's probably the first time I've seen a Series 1 episode of Brum, which is Seaside. I like this story. It's, it's wonderful, brilliant stuff. Uh, pretty nice, actually. So that's the sort of ragdoll section, of course, because you've got Thomas Nash and for, uh, Friends First, which is solely Brit Holcroft and everything else, that sort of thing. Then you've got the ragdoll stuff. Now we're going to the Thames stuff next. So next up we go is Rainbow. So this is Sing Song. This is uh, this with Roddy, Jane and Freddie sing a song. It's about music and everything else, that sort of thing. Uh, pretty decent, not bad. Then we've got Lonely Sooty. This is Start to Read. This is. Um, Matthew tells a story about a guy called Ronnie falls into the ice and every, you know and that sort of thing really just like you just it's Matthew Taylor's story in this excerpt really I'm not sure what the whole video contains really you might just check on YouTube really and then we've got the wind in the willows and we got two stories from series four we do and these are from the Lord Toad video Hall for Sale and Toad's Harvest obviously so it's excerpts really so for Hall for Sale you've got the excerpt of Toad um, you know telling Badger Ratty Mole they sold Toad Hall really and just basically live a life away because of the and obviously there's the railway problem going on at the same time there is and obviously badger thinks you know, he's just abandoned everyone leaving them just to be the wild wooden everything else is being destroyed really the riverbank everything you know by the by the railway then he flips and he goes to toad toad's harvest which he's in the kitchen doing his canning machine of course burning his hand and everything else and matching him all the time and tell him did he blanch the vegetables no he didn't obviously i do remember these ones obviously I did actually made a compilation and put on the Winnie the Willows Facebook page. So I included it on there along with the other ones, of course. So that's the Thames stuff added, you know, the Thames section done. Nursery play, um, Elizabeth, or something, Nursery play rhymes with Elizabeth Fox. 
Yes. <laughs> if you're happy, if, if you know it, I think that's the only one there is, really. It's like, you know, ugh. I don't really care about that sort of stuff. It's only one song, so it's normally, it's only one song, so it just gets through it. And we finish off with Top Team Tim with Top Team Tim Go Swimming. Um, yeah, I think it's all right. You know, I like Top Tim. I read the books as a kid. And uh, yeah, it's, de it's nice and decent, you know, nice little fun one, it is. Before we start, start off with uh, John's Peaceful compilation from Anna 4, we must talk briefly about John's uh, Peaceful favourites from Anna 3. Because um, video, it's a video I didn't own, really. And um, I would say it's one of the week, it's the week one out of the sole main series, 392 and 95, really, I would say. Uh, largely because i never grown up with it, really. And, um, you know, I never saw any carpet sales. It's one of those ones that I've never actually appeared really and um yeah but there's some there's some decent stuff on it you know you got the brom, brom episode wheels on it that's pretty good i mean you got escape tom special friends episode on that one and um the a to z animals excerpts of this of lonely city decent actually very nice which uh funny enough that one and um the tots episode fox end up becoming on was it my best friend's video? Strange, strangely, you know, like the actual Lexo himself with the Tarko and everything else in that video, so it's a bit of cheap laziness, really. There's nothing much to it, really, you know. It's all new, new shows for Tots TV and Wizardora at the time, really, so it's like a new thing, really, you know. You have Nursery Playrams, again, with the same excerpt from the previous video, from the previous compilation, which is a bit strange, a bit lazy on that on that part. Let's move on to Children's Peace School compilation from 904. Again, I've got this one, the same carpet style I got from. Uh, special collection, obviously, not the same time, just a different, different Sunday, really. We open with uh, Thomas Tension Friends, Trust Thomas, an episode. I would say um, I don't mind it as much, really. It's not one of my favourites of Series 3, really. Not much to say about that one, really. Uh, next up we've got Ears, Sutting Codes, the first episode moving in, just an excerpt, really. Uh, nothing, nothing spectacular, really. Just just them acquainted to the new shop, really. It's the, it's the first episode, so why, you know, why not? It's decent, it is. Now next we've got is the Magic House. This this is Airfare. Now this is a uh, another new show. This this came out around the same uh, about the same year it was aired. Really, also the videos come out at that time. Um, I always remember it's a very interesting puppet show. I think I, I told my thoughts on it. It's one of Paper Nostalgia years back, really. And um, you know when looking back on it, I think like I don't remember that show. When I remember watching this, I thought like, ah, I do remember this. And obviously, still comes back to me. So next episode, we'll come back to it. It's Airfare with. Um, Grandpa Clock not feeling well, and he eats a bunch of magic grapes, and he just flies up in the air. But for what it's worth, Magic House is decent, really, and the theme song's pretty nice. Next up we go to Tots TV, this is Lima, this is, um, Tiny's just, just jumping up and down, really, so it's like a nonsensical thing, it's like, you know, I mean, it's Tots TV, it doesn't really, they don't mention any episodes on the packaging or anything else, really, they just allude the shows, of course, so you can actually tell why it is. You know, you just cut for a clip, really, of, you know, you know, of a story, like a random moment, really. Rainbow. This is um, this is the. I'm thinking I'm someone doing these out, out of order, really. In some ways, you know, it's not the full thing, really. Toy Shop Rainbow, obviously, and uh, I don't know. It's not really. It misses the magic of what Rainbow what Rainbow was, you know. Um, you know, with with Jeffrey included, and it's just like you know all of the stuff that they learn in films. That's the best part about it, really. Of Rainbow here, they tried to do something different, and it's just like. Meh. I might have done a similar thing where I didn't talk about Path Nostalgia, maybe. Yeah, I can't say much about Rainbow, really. I think over time it's sort of like, you know, they tried something different, but it's different worked out. Next up is Rosie and Jim. We have two excerpts on this one. We've got um, Eggs and Puppet Show. I prefer the Puppet Show better, really. Actually, a bit more engaging, I would say. More John Cunliffe. And, uh, yeah, pretty nice and decent. Topsy and Tim. Topsy and Tim goes to school. I think I do have a book of that somewhere. Of the old lady books when they reissued them back in the 90s. Yeah, because it's, it's when Tim... Um, Tries to find his coat, you know, and he saw sort of misses his coat obviously because he's his coat's got an umbrella on, like a black umbrella. Now next up was the wind of the willow. So this is a two excerpts from the tale, a tale of two toads. Interesting. I think at the same time this got reissued. This did in I four. Tale of two got reissued. It's really good. Fantastic animation. Everything else, brilliant stuff. He only has the kidnapping of Toad from Isabel and the weasel, uh, Chief Weasel, and then the showdown with Isabel in the in the in the, in the grounds of Toad Hall, well, inside Toad Hall. So that's like a, a really good, strong highlight of this compilation. Then finally, we've got the Grand Old Duke of York, which is basically just kids singing mercy rhymes around a park, and that's it. You know, here we go on the rubber bush. Oranges and lemons. So there we go. Then finally, we finish off with children's pre uh, preschool favourites from 1995. Don't know why the two, you know, don't know why there's two called the same thing, but there we go. So this came out in 1995, and this is the last, um, video to release under the video collection label 
of what it was since since the 80s, the mid 80s. It's interesting, you know, that, that's the final one that, that they re actually released and um, the next video released in the VCI was Bouncy Castles. It was, the Rosie and Jim video. So this is, um, again, um, just, uh, just another one with excerpts and stuff. I mean, mainly excerpts this time. So you see the um, the trend come on for, uh, until John's Pace with Favorites in 97. So you get this one as well, like it's in the theme really. However, there's a decent amount on it. There is, you know, bite-sized bite excerpts and some new stuff actually included. So it's a bit, it still has that freshness to it as the what the four have done before. So this has come from Carbison, not from the same ones from I got special collection and compilation. It was from a normal cupboard sale near a place called Devil's Bridge. And why is, and why is it called Devil's Bridge, you may ask? Well, there's a long bridge that goes over like a stream, basically like over a river, really. And people used to jump off and go, go into the lake, really. However, a few times people had actually got killed by it, actually died from it. You know, jumping through a bridge and smacking it, you know, actually killing themselves instantly through the... Um, you know, for the water because the rocks and leaves. I remember, I actually remember going there a few times. I was younger and people were jumping off the the bloody bridge. They were, you know, in the sw in the swim trunks. Really, you know, you would see like a hot days and stuff like that. You know, I don't think it ever happened when I got the, this VHS. That's a bit of a, you know, it's probably be, you know probably before that or afterwards. Maybe certain times. Really, not when I got that comp this compilation. So that's gonna be a bit of a, you know, a bit of a You feel like. You know, I probably remember, remember, you know, remember it like when I all got this video when people were jumping off a freaking uh, stone bridge into the water, you know. So, mm, you know, they don't do that anymore. They banned it, thank God. We start off with not with Thomas Nash and Friends. We start with Teddy, Teddy Bear sing along with ABC Alphabet. I spent, I told my thoughts on this one, and it's uh, not good, really. I would say, you know, it's just two people bounce up in singing nursery rhymes and you know those eyes <laughs> you know i watched it for like mm, you know as a kid you know when i first got this table sing along magic ball creepy eyes and people jumping in bear suits around kids uh, that's weird next up we go is thomas and friends with special attraction from thomas and stepney one of my favorites actually i have it on thomas's train and obviously thomas and stepney so it's a favorite of mine for the series four next up we go is sutton co with camping out and it's basically just like clips of yeah it's just a clip of you know such a sweet game, you know, so I bet they can camp out in Manchester somewhere. And then that nice montage of them going around different parts of Manchester saying where we're going to stay. Next up we've got is Four Ways Farm. Talk about Four Ways Farm again. Absolutely. Um, this is the sound of music and this is the end This is the end bit when the animals perform together in the, in the, um, in the barn they do, you know, doing their bits. It's basically, it's basically the end bit really. And, and um, it's nice actually. I've, 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 seen sound, I've watched the sound of music before. One of the best ones I would say. Very nice. And, and sort of do the... Um, Always found um, tune very much so on that one. Draws in Jim Gingerbread Man, and it's a nice episode. I've talked about Gingerbread Man before, same with special attraction and sound of music. So, yeah, uh, just a nice episode. Just Pat Miss in Shark Game Gingerbread Man, really. Uh, the Wind of the Willows I'll do is next. Um, this is the exit, this is the exit from the 83 movie. This was, uh, it's the open road song when Ratty Mole and Toad are traveling around in the, in the yellow cart really with half of the horse and uh, you know just sing it just sing about the open road living the life of a traveler you know it's a nice one probably one of the more better ones to choose from the film really although maybe the seated hall total might have been interesting and then we come back to table sing along with one two three numbers again talk about nursery rhymes with numbers this for maxim is bounce up and down with kids there we go finally we end up with brum which is an excerpt from series two this is brum with a big chase this is basically the the dance sequence this is you know with the con with brum leader con line through a shopping centre with various people, obviously. Um, traffic wardens, builders, window cleaners, road sweepers, all sorts, really. You know, dancing to this, you know, what uh, Andrew McCurry Shard was making, really. Just like synthesised Congo drums, like a Latino cheap sound, really. You know, so it's, oh, it's decent, really. You know, that's, a, you know, that's decent. You know, I think it's all, I mean, it's all right, really. But I think they should have just done the chase, really. The chase scene with, with Andy Downpour as the robber, really going around a carpet, a carpet shop, getting trapped, you know, that one would have been good. Actually, no, we got to finish off with something else. We have, we have um, an advert at the end for Mega Machines, obviously, which um, I've talked about Mega Machines before on this series with um, awesome army vehicles. So you can check that out, really. Not much to say about that one, really. Just mention about stuff with John Leslie in it. Um, so they had the three, they were just advertising the three, really, obviously. There was four that were released in 95. Um, so you had the one fire engines, one with construction, one with army vehicles that were released through video collection. There was another one that was released 
I think in November actually, to do with police, and that was released by VCI actually. So I think that was a late one that came out. I think it's called Police, Police Go or something like Please Stop Go, something like that. And that's it. Um, that's the end of the video collection really as a whole with this final video. And that's it guys. I've been talking about the children's um, uh, preschool favourites collections really, actually. There were all three of them actually, you know, special collection from Night 2, compilation from Night 4, favourites from Night 5. So there we go. I've talked about uh, Play School Favourites on Night 7 already before and in a bit of a detailed ranting video. So there we go guys. Thank you guys for watching for this bit of a mammoth video really, as always. And um, I'll see you for the next videos. See you guys.